We're targeting 140,000 food packs daily. We are attempting no, and we are trying to do our best to attend to the needs of roughly 1.4 million of our countrymen who don't have food, who don't have water, who don't have electricity, and have sparse communications. Okay. Some areas, up to today, the local government unit has ceased to function. Okay. And our disaster risk response deals heavily with the backbone provided by the local government unit. Okay. Yung the destruction and the deaths are concentrated para by an area defined by Tacloban on Leyte side and Base in Western Samar, stretching to Giwan, Eastern Samar. At saka yung areas of Tolosan, Tanawan, Palo, also in Leyte. Okay. Yung physical movement, think about it, no? 140,000 of these food packs from here, Cebu, and eventually from Mindanao. No? Yung archipelago, yung, yung lack of power in the communication parts is really posing quite a lot of challenges. Pati yung roads that were isolated, all the national roads are now open. But again, put yourself in their situation, you have no sources of food, by tomorrow, it will be one week. Actually, it's one week now by today. And you have, you know, the sense of desperation will, will suddenly will sit in and sink in. Your efforts really help us to be able to master the necessary uh, sustenance for all of them and will greatly... Later on, the problem will be housing all of these people. No. But right now, it's the basic necessities. Food and water. Okay. Transport is ready. Funding is also available. Separate supply chain. No. We are working on that. That's why you will have your new supplies by about an hour or so, an hour and a half. And then the bulk will be by 9 o'clock. Okay. You, again, organizing that also is an extreme challenge. So, parang the suppliers themselves, siyempre, were not gearing up to be providing these quantities at this point in time. So, again, thank you. Now, you know, we will be able to overcome this. Yeah. And I guess for your generation, you know, the people in the most severely affected areas really need to feel your love and you are demonstrating it. So, thank you again to everybody and hopefully we will continue until this disaster is over. Maraming salamat rin po sa aming mahal na Pangulo.